Hello children. Today we would be doing something very different. We would be learning comparison. We would be learning comparison of things or comparison of numbers. We would be learning the concept of greater than, less than and equal to. Today we will learn to compare numbers. We will learn comparison of numbers. We will learn the concept of greater than less than and equal to and do you know someone special has come to help you all today someone special has come to meet you do you know who he is i will just tell you hello children hello this is coco this is Coco the Crocodile. Hello children, I'm Coco the Crocodile. Can you see my big mouth? Can you see my big mouth? Do you know children? Coco is very good at counting. And when Coco is hungry, he always compares the things or the numbers. And he always eats the things that are greater in number. He always opens his mouth to the things or the numbers that are greater. So Coco eats everything and now he would be eating all the greater things and he would be leaving the lesser things. He keeps his mouth closed at the lesser things, at the things that are less. So now let us give something to Coco to eat. Let's give him some stars to eat. Let's give him some stars to eat. So here I have some stars with me. Here I have some stars with me for Coco. And let us see how many stars do I have. Here I have one, two, three, four, five. Here I have five stars. And on this side I have one, two, three. I have three stars on this side. You need to remember one thing children, that as we move forward in accounting, the number increases. The value of the number increases as we move forward in accounting. And this is something very important for you to remember. So now Coco wants to eat the stars. I told you that Coco always eats the things that are greater or that are more in number. So here comes Coco to eat the stars. But which one is greater? Which one is greater? 5 is greater. As 5 comes after 3 and counting. So Coco would be coming to eat 5 with his big wide mouth. This is his big wide mouth. But we can't get Coco every time. So instead of Coco, we would put this sign of greater than and this is less than. When the mouth is closed, it is less than. And when the mouth is opened, it is greater than. Because this is like Coco's mouth. Just look here. It is just like Coco's mouth, this sign. So we would put the sign in the center. The mouth is open towards the greater number and the mouth is closed towards the lesser number. So now Coco would be eating number 5. 5 is greater than 3. 5 is greater than 3. Now let's give Coco something else to eat. Let's give him some flowers to eat. Let's give him some flowers to eat. Here I have some flowers. Here I have some flowers and let's count the number of flowers one two so here i have two flowers and on this side one two three four here i have four flowers i told you that coco likes to eat everything that is more the greater number and he leaves the lesser number he keeps his mouth closed towards the lesser number so here comes Coco to eat the flowers. He would be eating four flowers. He would be eating 
four flowers. Why? Because four comes after two and forward counting. So four is greater. So Coco would be opening his mouth towards number four. This is his big wide mouth opened and his mouth would be closed towards the lesser number. That means towards the number that is less. So now instead of Coco, I told you we'll be using a sign. This would be the sign, but just like his mouth. Look here, it's just like his mouth. So we would be keeping this sign here. And now, two is lesser than four. Two is less than four because two is smaller than four. So now let us give Coco something else to eat. Let's give him some smileys to eat. Let's give him some smileys to eat. Here I have some smileys for Coco. I have two smileys on this side. I have two red smileys on this side. And I have two smileys on this side. That is the purple smileys. But do you know one thing? Coco doesn't come when the number is the same on both the sides. He gets very lazy. He doesn't come. When the number or the quantity is the same on both the sides, when it is equal on both the sides, we put the sign equal to. Equal to means the quantity is same on both the sides. And the sign of equal to is so easy to make. It is just one sleeping line and another sleeping line under it. So Coco will not come when the quantity is equal. Now let us see with it. Let us see with some numbers. Would Coco come to eat the numbers? Let us see. Here I have some numbers with me. This is number 9 and this is number 3. Number 9 is under 1s because it is just one digit. So when we have just one digit, it comes under 1s. Its place value is under 1s. And here we have 3. Again, that is under ones. Its place value is ones because it is just one digit. I told you that Coco always eats the bigger number, the greater number. So now, instead of Coco, we would be using the sign because Coco has got tired and he is sleeping. So, nine comes after three in the forward counting. Nine comes after three in forward counting. So it is greater than 3. So when it is greater, we will put this sign here. Greater is the mouth open. And when it is less, the mouth is closed. So 9 is greater than 3. 9 is greater than 3. Let's see some more numbers. Let's see some more numbers. Now again, I have some numbers here. This is number two and this is number five. Both of them are under ones because there are just one digit and the place value is ones. So now, which is bigger, which is greater? Number five, because it comes after two and forward counting. So when five is bigger, we will open the mouth towards five. We will open the mouth towards five. Two is less than five. 2 is less than 5 because the mouth is close towards 2. Now let us see some more numbers to make it clear to us. Let us see some 2 digit numbers. Here I have some 2 digit numbers. So when it is 2 digit numbers, we write the numbers under 10s and 1s. So this is 1717 and this is 1414. Now let us see which is bigger. 17 comes after 14 in forward counting. But there is another way to do it fast. First, we will start from the 10 side. So here under 10s is 1 and here under 10s is also 1. When it is the same, we would check the next number. That is the number under 1s. Here we have 7 and here we have 4. 7 comes after 4 in forward counting. So 1717 is greater than 14. 1717 is greater than 14. It is greater than 14. 
if the first digit that is the one under tens is the same in both the numbers then we check the digit under ones so now let's see some more numbers let us see some more numbers here i have some more numbers with me this is 1616 and this is 2828 i told you when we check we always check first the tens number yes so here under tens i have one and here under tens i have two both are different so which is bigger one or two which is bigger one or two two is bigger than one two is bigger than one so two would be a greater number so when two eight twenty eight is greater the sign the mouth would be open at the number two eight twenty eight so 16 is less than 28 or 28 is greater than 16 now let us see some more numbers let us see some more numbers oh this is so easy why is it so easy because here i have just one digit that is under ones and here here i have two digits so one digit is always less than two digits one digit is always less than two digit numbers so when it is less than two digit numbers the mouth would be closed seven is just a one digit number so the mouth would be closed here and two three twenty three is a two digit number so the mouth would be open that side as it is bigger as it is bigger so seven is less than 23 23 is greater than seven now let us see some more numbers let us see some more numbers here i have two numbers but i think i think they are the same eight here and eight here both of them are under ones the place value is ones so they both are same they both are equal so what would we use which sign would we use we would be using the sign equal to because they both are same they both are equal so 8 is equal to 8 8 is equal to 8 let's see some more numbers now here i have numbers again with me this is 2323 2323 under 10s we have 2 here under 10s we have 2 here under ones we have three here under ones we have three here so it is the same it is the same so what would be coming we would be writing equal to in the center because both are equal because both are equal so i hope children you have understood the concept of greater than less than and equal to greater than greater than is like this the mouth is open less than is like this the mouth is closed the mouth is closed and in equal to we have this sign so do practice greater than less than and equal to